Hi, Hiram here. Gonna have another mail time here. Uh, this is something that I got on eBay. A couple of days ago, you remember, might remember that I did uh, mail time for this Through Night TH20. It's a headlamp. I had said that I bought this as a replacement for my favorite headlamp, the Through Night TH10, only because the TH10 used the large um, 18650 batteries and I wanted to get something that could be recharged I thought from a solar panel and this one the TH20 which is turning out to be a pretty cool headlamp too I'll do a review on this in a couple of days uses a double A size battery or it also uses the 14500s so when I did that uh, mail time thing I got a comment from 64 Marine, I'm sorry, 64 US Marine Semper Fi. You can charge these 18650s with a Tsar MC1 Plus charger with the XR plugged into your solar panel or a battery bank. So I thought I had never heard of these before. The charges I had always had to be plugged into the wall. So let me open this quick. Yep, that's what it is. So here I have, and I guess it's X-Star, MC1 Plus portable uh, Lion battery charger. China's got quality. Okay. And comes with a warranty card, little instruction manual. And in here is the battery charger. So this looks like it will take sorry it'll take the large batteries and it'll take the smaller ones and what it does is it has an input 5 volt input comes with a cable so I should be able to hook this up to my solar panels. So thank you 64 US Marine. Again, I had never seen, didn't know that they made them where you could plug them into a smaller voltage. I thought they all had to be wall jacked. Okay, so that's that. I'll play with that and give you a review on that. The next thing is something that I'm pretty interested in. Kind of follows along with what we've been doing here. Kind of a big package. Hopefully it'll fit in the camera. Um, you know I've been doing a couple of alcohol stove things lately. But I have a project that's coming up that I was looking for something alcohol stove related but just a little bit bigger. And I had one of my viewers contact me and said that he had an alcohol stove that he thought I might be interested in playing with. So he sent this to me. If I can get it out of here. Okay. Let me take the box away just a little bit here. I think I need a bigger table. Come on. What we have here is an Arago 1500 alcohol stove made in Sweden. Pretty cool. And the thing that I pulled off here is the plate that goes on. Just like so. So it looks like it's a simple alcohol burner. Let me just take this off for the time being. That instead of tanks and pressurized alcohol, it uses... Oh, this is the sealer. Oh, good thing I ordered a couple new ones of that. It uses a large tank that you just pour your alcohol in here. 
set it into the stove. Now when it's in storing, it has this little rubber pad that goes on here. When you bring this back down, seal it shut. There's a knob on the front for adjusting how much flame comes out. And it looks like from what I've seen in the pictures, can you see it here? When you turn this dial, this disc covers over the burning area here. And that's how it regulates the heat. Can you see that moving there? So this looks like a very simple alcohol stove, but on a larger scale. And like I said, I'm pretty interested in this. So let me play with this for a couple of days and I'll do a review on this. Okay, so I thank you for watching. I thank 64 US Marine for telling me about the X-Star MC1 Plus. I don't know what to call the guy that sent me this yet. I'm not sure what he wants, how he wants to be known on the on you know the videos, but I thank you for sending me this. Um, look forward to playing with it. But I look forward to your input, questions, remarks, helpful suggestions, and as always, watch for my buddy Max. Bye now.